Hey guys, Carter from Clarity Auto. Uh, today in this video, I've got a time lapse for you guys of me washing my own car with O and R. Um, I'm just gonna talk to you guys about the processes involved, um, how to do it safely um, and correctly while you can watch uh, me do it on my own personal car. Uh, so O and R is a rinseless wash. We don't know what that means. It means you don't have to actually rinse it off of the paint after applying it to the paint. Um, however, you can if you want to rinse before, which is what I'm doing right here. I'm rinsing it with my power washer before I actually start using O&R on the surface. Um, while this is not necessary, it is handy. Um, <clears throat> it can be safer to actually rinse the car off before you start applying O&R. Um, so there's my bucket with O&R in it. Um, I'm taking an Eagle Edgeless 500 towel from the rag company out of the bucket. I'm wringing it out until it's on the verge of dripping and then I'm applying it to the surface in straight lines. Next I take bead maker, put a couple sprays and then I take my drying towel which in this case is a platinum fluffle um, also from the rag company and I wipe the O&R along with the bead maker straight into the surface. <clears throat> now what this is going to do is the O&R and the bead maker both do provide lubrication and uh, the bead maker is going to leave behind a layer of protection for me. Now when I get to the glass, after I finish drying off my glass, I'm actually going to put just a tiny bit more bead maker on there and wipe that into the window with my glass towel, um, which is a waffle weave low pile towel. Um, and that's just going to help me get a streak pee finish on the glass so that I don't have to go back and clean the glass later on, um, which is pretty cool. So a little bit about o &R. O&R is a polymer, not a soap. It's zuterionic in nature. Um, think about two magnets, try to stick them together, and they're on the same side, so north and north, they won't push together. That's kind of what it's like inside the bubble, so the dirt actually gets trapped inside the bubble, making it safer uh, than traditional wash methods. So about the two towels, I'm actually alternating the towels because when O&R is inside of the bucket, um, it's actually going to release the dirt from the towels and drop it down to the bottom. Now to just let the towels have a little bit more time, uh, I'm alternating between the two towels that are inside of the bucket. Um, now O&R does also have emulsifying technology like soap and water. Um, so while it's encapsulating it, it's actually breaking the dirt down into smaller and smaller and smaller particles. So O&R is going to do a really great job of just really safely uh, removing the dirt. Now you can see there again with the glass towel um, on the glass after the initial drying. I just do a second drying with a little bit more bead maker. Bead maker actually can work sometimes as a glass cleaner, which is it's pretty cool. Um, so yeah, I like that a lot about bead maker. Um, and I'm getting close to the end of this side of the car. Um, I'm going to stop the time lapse at the end of this side of the car since you can't see the other side of the car and I'll bring you in for the after footage of what the car looks like after the whole on our wash. Thanks for watching.